Life is like a barbecue. Assalamu alaikum rahmatullah. Hameen here with Sarah Masters developing the Muslim mindset for success. Now check this out. So I'm just here barbecuing and it took me a while to get this barbecue going and that is the topic of today's video. So with barbecuing I always forget how to do it correctly and each time I relearn and then I forget and I relearn. So anyway today uh, I relearn and I got a nice barbecue going nice and hot uh, but how did I do it right? First you start with the paper. Paper burns very easily and very quickly, starts to go at the bottom. Then on top of that, I put some of the smaller bits of charcoal for them to like, catch the heat and go on fire. And then finally on top of that, what's cracking? Uh, finally on top of that, I put the bigger pieces, right? Until it all goes nice and hot and white and fiery, okay? Now, what can we take from that? as Sierra Masters, right? We want to go far in our life and get a lot done so we get the reward in the Akhirah, inshallah. The lesson I took from that is to think of life in the long term, right? So, you know, what we, a lot of us were tempted to do with barbecues is get those big chunks because they're going to give off the most heat for the longest time. Get those big chunks and just set them on fire. Put a load of lighter fluid on it and then just like, light on fire and then there you go, you got barbecue. But as you know, if you must have tried that, it fails, right? The lighter fluid burns and burns and burns out and it's gone. And the big chunks of charcoal, they never lit on fire. They never got enough heat for long enough to actually start burning. So same with life, really. You've got to start uh, building a foundation. That's what I mean. You start with the small things. You're in school, you're doing different courses. You're not specialized yet. You're going, you're doing different things. You're learning here and there. You're getting a lot of experiences until finally you can put those small bits of charcoal on. That was the paper period where you're just burning that quick paper. You're getting these different experiences. You don't like that, you like that. You do it for a few months, you leave it. And then when something sticks, when you're interested in something, you're good at something, you throw a bit of small bits of charcoal on it and then it starts to burn, it starts to catch the, the flames and the fire and it starts to build a lot of heat. Other, unlike paper, it's got some real heat to it. Let me just flip these uh, peppers. Okay, so just flipping these peppers to the other side. So you found something that sticks a little bit. Uh, you, you, you've got those little charcoals going and then eventually, maybe, maybe it happens when you're 25, maybe it happens when you're 30, maybe even when you're 20, you start throwing those big chunks because they're gonna burn. They're gonna be slow burners for a long time, give you a lot of heat for a long time. And so you throw them on and now you've kind of caught what you wanna do and what you will continue to do for, for the biggest period of your life. And again, that might, that might stick at 20, it might stick at 30, it might stick at 35. But you've got to think of it in, that, in those terms of the long period, the long term, right? You can't find that thing, you can't throw the charcoals on from day one. You've got to get the paper, the little bits of charcoal, then the big lumps that are going to burn until you're 50, 60, 70, bi'idhnillah. And so, you know, it's, it's important to be patient. That's what I realized that, you know, a lot, of, a lot of people these days, they're living till they're 60, 70, 80, 90 beyond a hundred subhanallah and it's not like it wasn't like that before and so we've got to realize we've got we we perhaps have a, a lot more time than before uh, we want to have a certain minimum obviously because we could die at any time but when it comes to specializing and really committing and going deep into something which is something that i do uh, advocate for um you need to start with the paper and throw stuff on and just see really what sticks so you know for me you know, beyond 20, 21, 23, etc. I was throwing a lot of paper all over the place, burning a lot of paper. And sometimes it was just burning and then it was gone. And sometimes, you know, there was enough to throw some charcoals on there until I found the things, you know, there were two or three things that I could throw big chunks of charcoal on. And, you know, I think that will carry me forward, inshallah. But it, it did take me a long time and it felt like I was taking a long time to, to find those charcoal things those big chunk of charcoal things. Uh, but you know, it's different for everyone. And it's important to see things, you know, in that 20, 30 year uh, window, you know. So uh, I hope this is this is kind of something different, something a bit practical for this week. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. 
Now this has been Amin with Sira Masters. Think of the long term, three, you know, see what sticks, experiment a lot at the beginning, and then commit to something, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. Thanks for watching that video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you're interested in how to design your mindset and design your lifestyle as a Muslim so you can get everything you want done, then make sure you subscribe to this channel for at least weekly videos and check out the website right there where you can download free mindset resources and look at our blog with all the articles and stuff there. Uh, check it out and uh, see you.